And by any eventuality, we mean that if there is an influx of infectious cases or a mass casualty incident, that the hospital is ready to accept those patients. As a result of that, the hospital saw the need for the reactivation of Harsons Point, where if we become overwhelmed and we have more than four infectious cases, which we can deal with at our Enmore facility, we will bring those patients up here to Harrison's Point. In this area right now where we're standing, we have prepared and outfitted it to be able to accept 20 patients, but this area can accept up to 38 patients. We have all of our ICU beds, our theaters, and all of those critical services at the Queen Elizabeth Hospital. Those are not replicated here at Harrison's Point and therefore it is um, easier for us to make that extension uh, for the critically ill patients at Queen Elizabeth Hospital and the less acuity patients at Harrison's Point. We have also outfitted our Ward A3 with an additional eight beds in anticipation that if we have an influx and our main operating theaters become full and by extension our recovery room it means then that we will have an additional eight beds that we can accommodate those patients to clear the theaters